Yeah, 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 yeah. What's up, guys? It's Kiri2, and we're back with Let's Farm episode 11. And right now, I'm just showing you guys that everything is done. Only thing I have left is these 149 walls, my heroes, and a few things in my lab. But all the defenses are actually maxed out until the next update. Um, and now we're going to show some of my defenses. This base has been winning more than I thought. If you remember the last episode, sometimes I'll lose here and there. I was actually on a winning streak of about six defenses straight. And just yesterday, I won three in the same day. I kept going offline, even though waiting for my troops to be made. And I just kept winning. So this guy actually broke into three sections down here. Drops a golem on each side. Um, so distract all the weapons right there. And then it's following up with wizards. And he's doing a go wipe. A lot of people like to do go wipes. Um, he's doing a go wee wipe. But the way he's doing it, he's actually clearing a bunch of weapons here. So the heroes are going to go straight into the base because these sides are going to be taken out. Uh, I don't remember if I actually win this one. I might actually lost this one. Because uh, I believe this is the best way to attack this base. And look, his heroes are ready in the center. <laughs> After I just said, oh my base is unbeatable. No, it's not unbeatable. I have been two starred maybe about twice. Mostly one starred. Uh, but look at him. He's already here in the center. He's at 46%. Uh, the queen, she might be able to get that town hall. Golems are split up. And the golem that was next to her has died. He uses a rage and has phased her already. She has 50% is on the town hall. Will she be able to get it? And she wanders off to the clan castle. So if I had no clan castle shoot, that was definitely a two star. So in my eyes, that was a victory. Because you only got the one star. Minus, minus four, not bad. Alright, so here's another defense by SSS, and he looks like he's going to do a, a double Lava Loonian. So standard, you drop the Lava Hounds first, the Balloons and the Minions. And then he's Lightning, my Clan Castle troops. He drops his heroes here at the top. Um, I didn't see him use Rage spells, so maybe that might be his downfall. You can see the Balloons are spreading off to the side. Oh, that was a super late Rage spell. He does make it to the Inferno, but the Inferno doesn't drop. He drops the Freeze on it. A whole bunch of minions on my Dark Elixir, but the other Inferno is on them. The Queen's here in the center. King's banging on a wall. If he maybe had a jump spell, he might have did some work, but the King's about to go down. Everything's about to go under. The Queen, he uses a phase ability. And I don't think they're actually going to get it. They're right here in the middle. So it's kind of scary. He's at 38%. He rages the King. And she's on the Town Hall. Can she do it? Come on, Queen. Come on. <laughs> he doesn't want to give me a shield. He was so salty. So this is... I have no idea. So, <laughs> he, so yeah, this base gets attacked a lot from the top and the bottom. And here's another attack from the bottom. Um, as you can see, he's also using another go wee wipe. Um, he's breaking into one section. And I can already tell right now, once he breaks through there, all this stuff's going to path around the side. So all the troops are deployed. He's going to drop the heroes soon. Maybe he's waiting for the right side to get cleared out. He waited. He didn't wait long enough because now they are pathing to the side. The Pekka's in the middle. He freezes the Inferno and rages the Pekka. So the Pekka's right there. He doesn't have a jump. Oh, he does have a jump out. He jumped into the middle. Those Teslas are going to work on those max level Pekkas. Level 40 heroes are stuck on this wall and they path to the side. I think he deployed too soon without taking those buildings out. Now they're going to go here to the side. Wizard Tower, everything is right there taking those stuff out. And then soon you're going to see everybody path to the center. I believe the Queen's going to circle around once that stuff is done. We're at 42%. Uh, Tesla, everything is right there. He freezes them, he misses the Inferno. But the level 40 Queen right here is really dangerous. Um, if, oh dang, she's had her ability, her ability saved her right there. If she didn't have that, I believe I would have won it. The King is about to go down. So this is one of the two stars. Uh, really good raid by the guy. Um, I was actually surprised he actually won this. Um, since all the heroes went to the side and the golems went right there. That queen just did a real clutch with a really good free spell. Alright, so let's go for a live attack. Hmm, this base looks good. Um, a lot of loot. If you can see right here, they're actually in the collectors. Um, 
I don't have all my spells, so we're going to do my standard farming strategy. Try to distract with these balloons, like quickly follow up with the minions. Take as much percentage as we can. Since a lot of it is in the collectors, um, this is perfect for this type of attack since I'm not trying to get to the storages. Already at 34%, I dropped the king and the queen here on the right side since a lot of the weapons are distracted already. And they're breaking through, dropping the clan castle. Rage the king, we're at 49%. Uh, there is quite a lot of loot still available. There is a one star. Queen is at full health. We're going to wait till she gets targeted onto before we use her ability. Uh, and I'm going to let her keep going to try to get some of that expo and the firefighter achievement. See if I can get this expo. But she breaks it and then starts going for this cannon and then the air defense. So I'm going to end it there. She didn't go for the inferno. Pretty good loot with the loot bonus. And here's a view of my base. So let's request some more troops. And I think we're going to buy some walls. So I, I could afford about three walls, they're about a million each. Um, I like to get these corner areas because when wall breakers come in, they're going to do a splash. So let's buy uh, one more. I'm saving my elixir because my laboratory is going to finish up in a few days. And I'll start on this other corner right here. And we should have enough to also get my king up. So he's going to go to 25. 115,000. Plus four damage. Um, and 75 health. But what we're really looking forward to is that ability, 50 more damage with the ability, 164 health. So that's really good. And let's get him started. So seven days, he's gonna go to level 25. And yeah, guys. So right now we're just finishing up these walls, and we're gonna get the heroes done. And that lab's gonna be done in a few days. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. Leave a like and a follow and a comment, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.